Hello everybody, my name is Dude, and welcome back to what I have been assured is not a horror game, Star Drop. Um... Okay, so apparently Mr. Robot from earlier is not a thing that will kill us. And I hope that's correct, because, uh, yeah, that guy's not a horror thing. Where do I go, though? Do I go the other side? Sit. Security status, okay. Alright. So that was that. How about the other way? Did I miss it? I think I missed it. So that was the way I came. Oh, there was supposed to be some other... Oh, here we go. Wait. Was that it? Is this the way? Did I find the generator this way? Or am I going the wrong direction? Oh, I did go the wrong way, didn't I? I found the second generator. Doop, doop. And done. Did it work? Alrighty. That did it, Aaron. I can see the major systems coming back online. Uh huh. Be able to explore the rest of the ship now. Nice. Aaron. What? Don't move. Stay right where you are. Why? Stay right where you are. I'm detecting movement. I see him coming. There's no one here. Hold on, just one second. Oh my god. I'm so sorry, Aaron. It, it's a false alarm. Just to um. Seems like it was connected to the same power grid that got activated as well. Please don't kill me. It shouldn't pose a threat. My god, Joe. My heart skipped a bunch of beats just now. Uh, I should have expected this. I wasn't paying attention. Can I talk to him? I'm sorry. I wasn't thorough enough. It's all right. Shows you're just human. We all make mistakes. No, I, I can't accept that. I mean, if, if anything were to happen to you... John, enough. I'm okay. Nothing happened. Should I, uh... Move on from this, okay? Copy that, Aaron. Let's keep going. Should I be That's worried about the, the next one? We still have a whole ship to explore. Yeah, and I hope nothing kills us. Worst I want is to be thrown into the brig. That's it. I don't want to be having my, ne my neck snapped or my crew killed. So please don't do that. Please don't do that. That's not something I need. I have a mildly full bladder. I don't need to be pissing my pants. Alright, give me some time, let me assess the situation, and I'll come up with a game plan. Got it. I'll contact you ASAP. For now, you can make your way up to deck one. Got it. On my way. Oh, and Aaron, keep an eye out for any data pads lying around. They might contain information we can use. Good point. You're acting like this is my first time doing this. Well, excuse me, princess. That was so old a reference, I'm disappointed in you, John. I can't believe I got that reference. Oh my god, even we got that reference! Yeah, I can't believe you got that either. I'm disappointed in the both of us. I'm disappointed in myself. Legend of Zelda cartoon, by the way. That, that's, that's the reference. Just watch the opening. You don't even have to watch the show. Just watch the opening. You'll you'll get it very quickly, and you'll know it from then on. So what? I tried getting into the ship's network, but it seems the mainframe is offline for the most part. I okay. can't really do anything. You need to bring it back online. Do you know where it's hmm. located? Sorry, you're on your own. I'm being blocked off left, right, and center. I'm not able to access anything right now. Don't worry, I'll find it. Security control? Oh, wow. What? What happened here? John, are you seeing this? Yeah, I'm seeing the creepy flower robot. It seems like it ran out of power while attending the flowers. It's almost sad. Red flags, Aaron. It clearly went beyond its protocols, and that usually isn't a good sign. Please be careful. Don't worry. 
Whatever happened, it's displaying care rather than threat. And besides, it's powered down. Yeah, but when we power on the generator, would that... When we power on whatever generator we've got to power on, would that not turn it on? Oh, there's a safe station. I should probably use that. There we go. Star Drink! What's your favorite? Uh... I'm thinking I'm liking that buddy... Buddy Lightyear. Ha! <laughs> nice. I get the reference. What? What now? I'll get the main firm and bring it back online. And don't, don't forget to keep an eye out for any data pads lying around. They may provide useful information. Got it. Uh, this looks like a direction I should go. This is a mess hall. Never mind. So for a crew of androids and robots and stuff, uh, this is... Ooh. Hello, what's this? It's a can of something. Probably a drink of some sort. Or a thermos. It could be a thermos. That's another possibility. Likely a thermos. Can I open it? No. I guess not. Uh, personnel reports the conference room immediate emergency meeting current mission canceled. Parts of the conference room. Does that mean I gotta go to the conference room? Go to control crew bunks mess hall. Security control is locked. Okay, so that's a no. Anything around? Uh, no. That is a no. Alright. Uh, mess hall. Okay, that looked like an elevator, but I, I thought I also came from this direction. Deck 2 airlock. Yeah, I was on the airlock deck earlier, so that's not it. That, oh. Hello, security station. Also, security status okay. Data pad, what's up? Alright, what do we got? What do we have here? Uh, uh, there can be many things this goes out to all you explorers out there. Uh, there, hint at something. Here to explore who you are and find peace within and you'll be able to share it with those around you. Okay. Uh, let's see. I am at the airlock. Elevator bridge. Am I supposed to go to the bridge? I don't think I'm... Maybe I'm supposed to go to the bridge. Why the bridge, though? I thought that wouldn't work. Yeah, that's the mess hall. So there's an elevator past security. Is this it? This is it. This is the bridge. Bridge! It, it, that was a Star Trek reference, by the way. I wasn't just saying bridge for no reason. Even though that's totally the re Even though references are pretty much for no reason anyway, so it doesn't matter. But, uh, yeah. I'm playing Star Trek. Even though this isn't Star Trek at all. Uh... Deck Zero. Bridge, Med Bay, Lab, and Mainframe. Okay. Maybe status okay. Apparently we're just okay. Authorized use only. Okay, so let's not interfere with much. Assuming I should interfere with anything in the first place. Hmm. Uh, 
Hello. I wish to power John, on come everything. In. I'm inside the mainframe. Good. Copy that, Aaron. Boot her up. Reset. Um. Good things? Good job, Aaron. I'm inside the network. Cool. Yeah, I've got a slight issue here. Why? What's that? I'm trapped inside the mainframe. The door's closed when the servers came back online, and it's also locked up the door panel. I can't get out. Yeah, that's a problem. Mm, hold on. I should be able to open the doors from here. <laughs> really? Really? Intermission? <laughs> really? Really? Good, good job. Good job. Good okay, job. I've got some good news and some bad news. Is the good news that you Why can open the door? Surprise me. The good news is that I'm able to navigate the ship's network. The bad news is that the mainframe is directly linked to the security system. Oh. It looks like when I override the door controls, a lockdown protocol will be initiated to isolate any intruders inside the mainframe, and there's no way I can get around it. Hmm. I can open the doors, but you'll have to manually disengage the alarm system. Wow. Okay. That's, um, inconvenient? Well, it's a non-lethal security system. Oh, good. So all I gotta do is head for the security station and shut it off? Yes, but after that the security system will remain active. What does that mean? So let's say you're in the line of sight of a security camera. When that happens, you'll have three seconds before it triggers the alarm. So I have to move out of their sight? Correct, or else we'll trigger the alarm, lock down the entire deck, and you'll have to head back to the security station and reset the alarm. Okay. Sounds easy enough. Well, shit. It really is. Alright, I'm going to open the doors in three, two, one. Here I go. Oh. Okay then. That's not so bad. Okay. Man, I do not like security systems. They are way too noisy. Uh. Hey, Aaron, I have a new objective for you. What is it? Lay it on me. You need to shut down the security system manually. It's the only way to open up all the gates and give you access to the entire ship. There's a control room on deck one, which should let you shut it down from there. Okay. But first, you need to figure out how to get to it. There's a gate blocking the way near a flower robot. Flower robot? Really? Oh, I'm sorry. I meant to say creepy flower robot. That's even worse, rude. <laughs> well, there's an elevator More rude. Used to get there, though. You can access it through the cargo bay. Okay, sounds good. Any ideas how to get to the cargo bay? Deck one. Well, you gotta head back to deck three and find a way to unlock the elevator there. We'll sort the rest out when you reach it. Sounds like a plan. Hmm. So I need to go back to this thing, right? Well, here's deck one. I needed to go to deck one anyway. But if I need to go to deck three to get to deck one, then what's the point of this elevator that I'm right behind? Or that I'm inside right now? I don't get it. I don't get it. Hey, Aaron, before I forget, now that the mainframe is back online, you should be able to access the computer terminals on board. You can read emails, listen to audio logs, who knows what you'll find. Good idea. Thanks. Are you, are you on? You find anything by a Martian prince? Nope. Do not believe it. <laughs> Roger that. So Flower Robot's not online. Which might mean he's still in a, like, a charging state. So I should avoid security cameras, or is that only an issue when they're red? Oh shit. Okay, so I should avoid security cameras at all times. 
Okay. No, Ted. Where's the conference room? Wait. Gonna go to deck three. This is not deck three. Where the hell's the elevator again? This is it. This is the mess hall. This isn't it. Ah. Go away! Deck two. Oh right, I was on deck three. I was in the engine room. And then there's some other way around to deck one that way. I don't know anymore, man. This is a big back and forth I got going so far. Hopefully Mr. Uh, Repair Drone doesn't get any murderous intent. I don't want that. At all. Ever. Thankfully, this, they said he said the security system wasn't lethal. Eric, so. come in. Yep. What's up? I just found out the androids on the ship are also linked to the security system. There's one down there with you, remember? What? Ah, oh, fiddlesticks. Fiddlesticks. You're right. I almost forgot that. It will trigger the alarm immediately if it sees you. And if you make enough noise, it'll be attracted to that. Just use your object scanner to Fucking avoid Fucking shit, dude! <sighs> Great. As if I didn't have enough reasons to be creeped out by this thing. I know. But don't worry, I checked their security protocols, and they're also harmless. They won't attack you or anything. Somehow that doesn't make it any less creepy. Anywho, it really doesn't. just locate the override control panel. That's the only way you're going to be able to open the doors to the control room. Gotcha. I did not want that. Uh. Here we go. There's a blue dot, a red dot, and several other things, so I need to go there. Okay. You know, that's the elevator I just came from. I think. Oh, that's what that looks like. Okay, so... That's the elevator I came from. I need to go through that tube and then in there. Okay. So... Shit. What do I do? This isn't security. Shit. Okay, what do I do? Security station. Is that way? Oh, please don't turn. Thank you. Okay, so I need to go behind me. This way. This is the control arm. Shit. Oh no. Of course it's locked. Well, how do I, uh, disable this? Is that all it does? It's just red alert? Is that all it does? It's just red alert, like nothing else?
And is this the thing I need to access? This is what I need to access, but it's locked, so... Shit. Security station... is around the corner, and I went the wrong way. So, this way... This way... And then off. Okay, so I need to go here... Fuck. It's fine, it's fine. You're not gonna kill me, but oh god. Fuck. Hello. You. Let me go, please. I mean, yes, I'm an anomaly. What do you do? Hello. Did I break you or something? I think I broke him. He just kind of like turned his neck and that was it. Okay. The elevator doors are open. <laughs> Great. They should lead to the cargo bay. Copy that. Can I just turn them off? Completely? Like, all of them? Okay, elevator of the cargo bay is this way. I believe the security in other decks is not lethal as well, because I don't need that in my life, thank you. I didn't seem to have a health bar, but... Eh. It's very soft core horror, and it's something I'm appreciative of because I don't need that. Okay, Aaron. So, you basically just need to head over to the other side of the cargo bay to get to the elevator leading back to deck one. Easy peasy. Lemon squeeze. Uh, about that. Um, you're not gonna like this, but there are more androids down there, and a bunch of security cameras. You're right. I don't like this. I really don't. It's not all bad, actually. I'm detecting a couple of network terminals down there. You should be able to use them to overload the, uh, network. Just use whichever terminal you can and overload it. One of the androids will have to go down there and fix it, ignoring you along the way until it gets there and fixes the overload. So I can distract them using that? Correct. Huh. Cooldown timer will be shown on the display panel indicating how much time the android will need to fix the issue. It will start counting down once it arrives. Okay, that's pretty helpful. Indeed. So the time it takes for it to reach the terminal plus the actual cooldown time should give you a nice window to sneak through the rest of the cargo bay. Okay, gotcha. Just keep in mind that this does not affect the security cameras. Okay. I gave myself a lot of time there. Alright, time to move. I had no game plan. At all. Well, that's what that is. Oh, great. There's a gate blocking the path to the elevator. There has to be a control panel somewhere down there. Oh, I'm looking. Oh boy. It's not very easy, is it? Why can it never be easy? Do I need to reset this? I do. 
Well, shit. No wonder. Probably blocking my progress. Because of that. And then this one... Ignore me. What? No. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. Another mats. Okay. So far, so good. I hope. Why can't the robots be friendly? That's all I ask. All I wanted in life is just some friendly robots to talk to, or not talk to, and I just kind of stay out of their way, but no, I can't even be seen by them. <sighs> I suppose asking for every robot I meet to be Lieutenant Commander Data is too much. I can't tell them I come in peace, because they... I do! I do come in peace, they just don't like that. What have we got in the way of, uh, thingies to worry about? Oh, no, never mind, we're not. We're not in a bad locale. Shit. We're over here, right. Okay, well, so... I'm finally at the security office. Bad. There should be an override control panel somewhere inside. In this thing? That's this void. Is this the override panel? No. Hmm. Maybe the data pad had something. Log. Five six nine zero. Okay, thank you. Six nine zero. Done. Someone please disable the keypad in the med bay. The medical team and the research team are always in close contact, and I don't understand why there's a lock in the room that resets itself daily. I keep forgetting the key codes and have to ask James or Yesenia to open the door. I would really appreciate it if we could just ditch the whole thing altogether. Cool. Keypad is malfunctioning and has reset to the default factory code of quadruple zero. One of the engineers had to, has to take a look at it once we return to SD00. Zero. Zero. Okay, so that's what this is. Aha! No tit. Mainframes are online. Plate security, oh, system shutdown, override control. Okay. Oh, it's official. Ship is all yours now. I wonder if it changes name. Hmm. Please don't call it the Enterprise. I reserve the right to call it the Enterprise. The security cameras as well as that android should leave you alone from here on out. Oh, All good. The security gates are opened, and I'm able to navigate the network without any issues. For now, however, you're free to explore the entire ship. When you're done, you can head to the bridge and help me extract those coordinates. Cool. Sounds good to me. Thanks, John. What would I do without you? I don't know. That is a good question. Let's go see what he would do without us. <sighs> well, that was unnecessarily scary. In some way. Wait, do I need to go to the ship's bridge or my bridge? Probably the ship's bridge. I would imagine. Let's save here for now. Then go to the bridge. Hmm. The bridge door is still closed. Huh. I can't open it from here. It's set to manual override. You'll have to figure it out on your own. Sorry. Okay, mm. I'll get on it. Well, this is the captain's quarters of the meeting room, then... I would have to open it that way, wouldn't I? Change the passcode on your office computer as a precautionary countermeasure after the two breaches were detected. 2075. Okay. 
This is the audio log of Selena Archer, captain of the Stardrop SD-0 and the SD-01, dated April 27, 2197. At 1700 hours, we received an emergency notification and a recall issued by First Officer Andrew Collins. We are to head back to the Stardrop immediately, and our surface mission has been cancelled. The hmm. exact nature of the recall and the emergency itself is classified. However, the notification we received stated that there is a clear and present danger, which jeopardizes the safety of the entire crew, both on the SD-01 and the Stardrop itself. An emergency meeting was held with the Chief of Security and the Chief Science Officer, as well as the medical staff following the recall, making preparations for the emergency evacuation procedures. An official evac has been declared by Andrew Collins, and we have to leave everything behind on the SD-01 the moment we dock. We'll be arriving at the star drop in approximately 15 minutes. This will be my only formal log regarding this issue while on board the SD-01. So... Something happened. Are these other logs? What are these? That's not what I meant to press. Are they still alive? I imagine probably not, but there's no one to ask. Uh, wait. 075? Okay. That was interesting. Just within an hour of each other. Wasn't an outside action either. The security tracker could not pinpoint a source location. No could you have used? No one has used any means of the stations to hack from. I don't know what to make of it. Oh, was there a code I was given? No, no, there was not. So, are you one of the droids? Check in here real quick for a log entry or something. Maybe there's some. Yeah, here we go. I'm not gonna read it yet, but it's something I could keep in mind for later. I guess. That's locked. Goody goody. I have arrived at the bridge. Is this John, tactical? Come in. I'm on the bridge. Great. The flight data should be on one of these terminals. I'll take a look around. Probably the one with the lock on it. Question is... Are they all locked? Nope, not that one. Oh, uh, what's this one got? Lock, still through it. John, it's here. It's all here. This ship definitely belongs to the Star Drop. I still can't believe we found its location. The Star Drop? Man, that's unreal. Holy cow. This calls for a celebration. Once you get back to the ship, I'm gonna party like it's 1999. <gasps> what? John? The bridge door closed. I know. Um. John? I know. Can you hear me? That voice. Please respond, I don't have much time. That voice. I know. What's going on? Can you hear me? I don't know, I... John, trace the signal. What? Trace the signal, now! Please respond, I don't have much time. This is Aaron Vance. I can hear you. Who is this? My name is Ido Hamada. Okay, hello, Ido Hamada. That's How can I help impossible. you? I'm... sorry. Why is, Why is that impossible? Because Ido Hamada passed away over 90 years ago. You can't be him. Um... I... I don't know what... Maybe we should take this one problem at a time. Know, please, I can't explain right now. I don't have the time. I'm sorry. Okay. So all I ask is for you to help me. From one explorer to another. I'm sending the coordinates in my location. 
You're my only hope here in Vance. How do you know my name? John, this can't be real. Um... I cannot explain what just happened. I traced the signal and it matches the coordinates I received. I also recorded the broadcast and downloaded whatever I could what? from the database. The year got the, the game got released. Now, okay. So. Okay. Twenty eighteen. I want to go home. Rejected. Twenty seventeen. Back to the air. Rejected. Leave the moment you're back. There we go. Board. Let's confirm with Captain Archer that we're forced to cancel the service mission and are to head back immediately to SD zero zero. Need your help to inform the bridge crew and plan a new route. Uh, please. Okay. Well, that was helpful. As in, it was not helpful at all. Leave the moment you're back on board. Just head back to the airlock, Aaron. We'll leave once you... Okay. We were sent coordinates, though, were we not? Something tells me it's not going to be that simple. I'm going to save here and end the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'm going to continue this. Because it's not super scary. It's just spoopy. Mildly spoopy. We're good. It'll be fine. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you to Shrill. Let me know for supporting me on Patreon. And thank you to Whirlybird, Dark Castle, 3DS, and Cat for supporting me on Twitch. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!